very honored. It's definitely an important infrastructure for our research, for many researchers in my community. So I see it as a um, great chance <laughs> to, uh, to also thank back praise for giving me compute time. As we have also seen in, in this meeting here in Barcelona these days, and what actually my son also mentioned when entering the auditorium, it's all men here. Um, so I think it's important to show um, that it's a good place, it's a good community to work in, um, also for women. And I do see that in biophysics, biomedicinal questions at our university, um, girls and, and female young researchers are represented at a high ratio and to show actually computing is a good tool instead of the microscope or the wet lab is one way to attract very many women so I think this prize also helps on that side. I do think that um, the prize is one thing. Um, I now realized actually only now that there's a website also that wants to present diversity. Um, I do think though that the outreach of these activities is not yet perfect. I learned of both the prize and the website when, while I was winning the prize. Um, so here I think this could be improved. If there are activities then um, they should be so to say, promoted in terms of uh, towards actually the researchers, right? Not so much in the media, say, towards the public, but if you want to increase the ratio of females, then you better also um, um, get, ma make, make um, the researchers, like the PhD students, so to say, in the lab being aware of it. Yeah, I think this is one way, even though I'm always skeptical of, so to say, just the women unify within themselves and say, let's, uh, let's have um, activities. Um, I do think that it's very important that within whole praise, um, the consciousness of more equal opportunities and so forth should be there. Um, but this is something I, as far as I understand, um, this organization of um, more diversity in praise is trying to get to. So in this way, I think it's very valuable.